What is happening, y'all? It's your boy, the man in the iron mask. But in all seriousness, I did go back to that merchant. I picked up the helm. It's not quite as good. Uh, as you can see, we have, uh, you know, less less defense. Very minor. I mean, this is 8 poise, 5.8, 4.4, you know, 5.5, 4.2. Um, Fashion-wise, though, it's a big upgrade. So we're going to be rocking it. Now I just look like I'm a Templar knight that's ready to go around smiting stuff. I would have probably looked more more Templar-ish uh, before I went and, and got rid of my giant halberd. But, you know, a scythe, maybe he's an edgy Templar. Die, heathens. See if I can lure them up here. Next to everyone's favorite. Damn, dude. Dragon Fist is good. That also seems pretty good. I like, I don't know, Dragon Fist feels like it comes out faster, though. And I do like that, because I'm all about speedy casts. I will say, uh, not using a great shield and massive uh, weapon anymore, like having my weight lower, actually having poise, because I can wear having armor. That's uh, it's a big difference, man. Feels nice. Feels good. That's really good. This is my magical bubble of protection. Be wary of Archer. Ooh. Yeah, I mean, uh, I don't know. The scythe move set is is pretty good. Like, I really like the the uh, fists that cannot be blocked, but the scythe being able to hit multiple enemies that's that's a huge bonus, man. The other thing is enemies like that. Well, but then we got dudes like this. And it's like, oh, you have a shield? Yeah, how about, how about, I don't care. I don't care that you have a shield. My guy actually lined up a counterattack. Whoa, and now he's throwing blood at me? Let's go. Ash of War, Bloody Slash. Yeah, that was cool. I like that. Wonder if that was the uh, that was the, the 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 evil captain or whatever. Godric Knight Helm. That could be cool. Oh, that's a bit weaker. Poise is dropping another level. I can't be doing that. Can't be losing so much. Okay. Yeah, I'm thinking the scythe. Oh, I mean, and it's not. I could upgrade both and just keep them as a backup. So basically, focus on the scythe as my. Because I have that. Well, the thing is, I have multiple weapons. I have the scythe. I have my dragon fist. And then I have the faith thing. Dectus Medallion left. Dectus Medallion left. That sounds like a... The Great Lift of Dectus. Huh. 
The right half is in Fort Faroth in the Dragon Barrow, far to the east. Cool. I mean, we've already, uh, you know, found our way up. This looks like there's a jump, like a jump to there. And then I could jump to there. Why would I try and jump down? There's no items. Yeah, I think I'll just I'll upgrade the scythe. Because then I could be the dragon hand or the scythe, depending on the situation. And I can keep the fists around just for like, oh, this dude wants to use a shield? Okay, we can we can deal with that. Because the damage on him is not bad. You know, use it strictly for shielded up enemies. Especially if I'm making the dragon fist my my main. You know, I've never I don't think I've ever done a Souls playthrough where I focused on a having a fist weapon as like my primary choice. So that'll be cool. Uh where was that weird dude at? He was here. Let's go talk to him. Then we're going by the blacksmith. I'm gonna upgrade my stuff. And then we're going to go down into that sunken city and see what awaits us. Who wants to help me? I say, do you want to help? Ah, I did you more. Excellent news. Well done, my fine new one now. Go ahead. Bird steel dagger. Right then. I've much to do. First, What's that look? Well, under the earth tree, co-mingling with the demi-humans is made possible. Even the vulgar shall not be left behind under the rule of true order. Which is why I, Kenneth Height, next in line as the rightful ruler of Limgrave, have sworn to uphold it. Just you watch, my friend. Just you watch. Oh, I just realized I've been muted. I've been so excited talking. 
wonder how long I was muted for. Probably not that long. Either way, I now have the power of both the dragon and faith. And that's dope that it adapts the moveset. This is going to be freaking cool. But I wonder if it's going to mess up because, or, or will the uh, shield pierce effect go to both? I don't know. I still can't believe I had enough to get them all upgraded. That's badass. Even my, my uh, talisman. I spent all that time like testing, like, well, I don't know which one I want. How about both? The best answer. Upgrade everything. It's like a little cooking set out here. What's up, boys? Oh boy, okay, yeah, you guys are definitely not here to play nicely. So what happens if I... That's trash. That's what I get for messing around with items. That's okay. I want to see what would happen if I'm dual wielding uh, the dragon in the main hand. So I know the dragon thing said cannot be dual well. Oh, we finally died and our faith is down. That sucks. That sucks. Well, let me see now. If I had that on, and I had that on. Yeah, no, you could do it. And then I would have... Alright, so because it's not dual wield, I would still... So which of these is the stronger of the two? Well, it doesn't matter right now because I've, uh... I've lost my powers. Damn! Damn! That's what I... Man... Ah... God, that's frustrating. You know what? Hang on. We're gonna see if I can get a level. Because even if I need to work back up to the 30 faith, that's fine. I knew that those stats weren't, uh, you know, everlasting or anything. But I want to use my new talisman for casts. Stuff to try out. Those two. Yeah, so 27 faith is our next breakpoint. And since that got uh, nerfed on me. Well, not nerfed, but since I lost access to it. Let me pull out one of the ranged weapons too, just to have one. 
Black key crossbow, 14, 16, you're 24, 18. Yeah, sure. Uh, and then my arrow types, can I use... These are arrows, these are bolts. Stronger. Meteor. What does this do? Magic damage, fire and explosive, scarlet rot, great bolt, as large as a spear for use with the hand ballista. Jesus. So that's like a, I'll put it on as I need it type situation. Man, I can't believe I lost my buff because I was fiddling around with shit. That suck. Wow, that's pitiful. I'm only at 2,000. I guess I spent it on items and stuff. How much do I need to level? 20,000. Damn, bro. Something up there. We have to drop down to it, though. I don't know how I feel about Dragon Maw. I'm having a lot of trouble gauging the, the distance on it because it's a really large windup. Dragon Claw, though, that's good for sure. you can get it off, that's good. It's like a delay on the two-handed swings. They're, they're not, not quite as good as the one-handed swings. Mm. 
it's just a alternate route that you could come through if you don't want to fight your way up. You could fight your way through the river. Or just run your way through the river. <laughs> Running seems to work quite well there. And sometimes mount combat, big sad. How do I get onto that thing? It's just gonna bother me. Unless it's like you got to go all the way around and it's a giant inside structure. Let me go over here and take another look. I mean, it's possible it's it's extra large like that, but yeah, because you got to drop multiple times to then get there. Drop from there. I really like that they don't just shove the scythe through the back anymore. Because that was always kind of like, yeah, well, it's not how you use a scythe, but whatever, I'm not gonna bitch. Alright, alright. This... This looks like a... Is there nothing else up here? No, so this drops... Oracle bubbles. You can tell though, they they had they had a lot of fun adding shit like that. Like, oh, there's this thing here. How do you reach it? Mm, maybe you should try using the jump button that we gave you. I'm glad you enjoyed yourself, from soft. Soap. Wash your dirty ass with. Come on, pillage it. What are you doing? Does it go deeper or back up top? Honestly, even though it's not the intent of this build, this could be pretty dirty for uh, for PvP. You know, we have a shield that's going to prevent healing. And then, uh, 
On top of that, we have a... Or the, or the scythe prevents healing. And then the fist weapons will pierce through all shields. Like... Those fist weapons, man, they're gonna make so many people upset. Because I feel like, um... New players, especially. Like, a new player's favorite friend in a Souls game is his shield. New players will hide behind shields until the end of time. And I mean, there's nothing wrong with that, you know? Like, you'll safe behind your shield. But they're just gonna be like, oh, gosh, there's, you know, backing up turtling, and someone's gonna come in with those fists and be like, yeah, how about no? And people are gonna be like, what the block? This guy's cheating. Guarantee it. Like, I'm gonna invade people at launch, and someone's gonna call me out for cheating by punching through their shield. I don't know how invasions will work at launch. I don't know what the, uh, the levels are. It'll be funny. Like, launch comes, and it's like all the, um, all the Souls veterans that got the game earlier. Like, here we go, invasion time. We just end up invading each other. It's just gonna be a big, big circle jerk of, uh, like me, Peeve, and Oro fighting each other over and over again. I don't like this. There's a summoning pool and a grace. There's a boss. And the boss is like right here, probably. And I'm really close to earning a level. I want a level. We're going to go sell a couple things to the blacksmith. It's like weapons or something, I don't know, we'll figure it out. Maybe probably consumables, I don't like selling weapons. Well, I'm not out. Okay, uh, I need, let me see how much I need exactly. I need... Do, do, do. Uh, 17... Hundred, almost exactly. Seventeen hundred and two. So, um, I haven't used these at all. I almost never end up using stuff like that. So it's twelve hundred. I need another five hundred and change. Um, there we go. That should do it. Yeah, going forward, pretty much everything is going to be faith. Actually, damn, I could respec again. Um, so I think I'm going to drop that one dragon spell. Wonder what the arcane difference was. Look. Thirteen arcane, sixteen, so three extra points. That felt really weak. I'm gonna try it out again, but it did not feel strong at all. Play my frenzy claps though, I know that. Um okay. Alright, let's see what we're up against. Maybe it's nothing. Light the flame. Alright, maybe there's not anything right here. Well, in that case, let's, um, I mean, this place looks huge. I think this is the, the Eternal Night City, or we're gonna get there. Um, no, wait, yeah, 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 because didn't that dude... I think the dude told us, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I don't have it, but that guy, the mission we were doing, didn't he say something about like, oh, blah, 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 there's a path down to the Night City, it's north of the Mistwood, and this is, uh, well, hidden in the Mistwood, this is it. This has got to be the Eternal City, so let's, let's wrap up here. Um, well, let me go see what's over here real fast, real fast, just, just gonna take a, take a little 
peek. Just a little peek. I don't know what this place is. Okay, never mind. There's a lot to this place. Let's wrap up. We're gonna wrap up. Uh, we did the riverbank. We got through that. We did the tower. It's a good amount of progress. We're gonna tackle this area and all of the... Ow! Oh, bitches! Alright, well now I'm getting revenge, but I'm getting it in the next episode. So y'all stay tuned and I'll catch you in a bit.